my love lips. This is gonna be the reading for the sign of Aries for the last 10 days of the month of March. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started with the reading. Uh, remember, um, this is a general reading, so take what it resignate, leave the rest. Um, remember also my readings are timeless. So if you happen to find this reading or come across this reading in another time that is not the end of March, this is the reading that you needed to find for your life and this is the message for your life at that time, okay? Um, I do an interactive reading towards the end of the reading. I'm going to be telling you, uh, you can, I can answer three questions for you. This is beautiful. Look at you, the Ten of Cups in the end, getting news from someone. So in the end of the reading, stay tuned to the end because I get to answer three of your questions, okay? Let's go get the message from the angels, from my sign of Aries. What the angels want to tell to my Aries? Okay, you have Maya, that's your angel. A schooling, a study, and education help your life, purpose, and personal growth. At this time, the angels will guide you and help you with this process. So you're gonna get a help from the angels from uh, with um, schooling and study. If you just already went to school, this is the perfect time to come back to school. If you feel like it's, um, if you feel like it, uh, just take the time to come back to school or learn something new. Sometimes we can learn things new, new things. You know, just with you too. You too is a wonderful place to learn new things and start new projects that we want to. We want to uh, do and get new information. It's a, it's a wonderful place to learn. Okay, let's go ahead and get started with the reading. You have contentment. You're going to be really happy this month. The universe is giving you what you want. It is a new job opportunity, a new opportunity investment to make money. Um, it is the end of a difficult situation with the Ten of Wands. It is something that it worries you with the Ten of Wands. It's something that you feel like it's too much for you to carry. But you get communication about this. You get communication. You have the Ten of Wands and in the bottom you have the, the Eight of Wands. That is the card of getting communication. Um, like meeting someone in the internet, having an online business, getting finally the communication that you was expecting to get. Um, this, this situation that I have you worry, that you feel that you like caring too much, it finally gets solved. The energy of money, like the money coming your way in and the prosperity and abundance. Look at you have the queen of pentacles, abundance, prosperity, new projects, even a new baby, a new relationship that grows. Okay. Um, it is really huge in here. It is a lot of energy and cards of money, 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 new projects, things getting complete. Uh, the tents are completion. The tents are like ending a cycle. It is a cycle of burdens and, you know, and um, maybe suffering and feeling like things are not going your way, that it's finally end with the Ten of Wands. And what is coming towards you is the Ace of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles, abundance, prosperity, money, a good relationship. The universe is giving you what you need. You even have the King of Cups. You have, it's just so curious because you have the King of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles. Definitely, you're gonna have a new relationship. It can be a person that comes from your past because you have the Ace of Wands, that is the card of communication, or can be a new person that it comes to you too. Uh, look at the Queen, the, the King of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles, how they are looking at each other. 
Look at that. The Queen of Pentacles is looking to his pentacles. And the Queen of Cups is looking for progression, for emotional stability. You're going to have emotional contentment towards the end of this month and the beginning of the month of April, okay? Um, things are going to go as you expected. Things are going to go better than what you was expecting. Um, you also have the um the knights of wands um uh, with you the knights of wands you have the the knights of pentacles it's a lot of, it's a lot of uh nines and tens in here it means that cycles that get to completions cycles that are towards the end and new things are coming you have two tens two nines in this reading um you, re you get communication from someone. Someone finally uh, communicates with you. You get a text message, an email, something that have to be with communication coming your way. And you have, you end your, your reading, Aries, with the, with the Ten of Cups, that it means happiness, contentment, family life, going in their best like being extremely happy about a situation, being happy, be like, look, look at this car. It is just happy life. And this is one of the best readings. Actually, this is the, one of the best readings for this month. I want to be an heiress, actually, right now. Because this is just wonderful money, uh, life. Uh, you're going to have some struggles with the, with the ninth oh, uh, ones. But things are going to definitely improve. Things are... Uh, you, you probably have some struggles right now, but things are gonna improve. Um, the energy is just big. It's just, it's just the energy of improvement. Things going in the way you want it. I'm gonna go ahead and do some clarifiers for this reading. Okay, energies for the sun of Aries for the end of the month of March. And I previously shuffled all the cards and meditated in your energy. That's why I just don't shuffle too much. I just shuffle once and that said okay a situation a situation that you just feel like you are trapped but then look you have the ace of you you had the ace of pentacles with the ace of sword it is it is a new relationship definitely it's a new relationship it's a new energy of relationship and this new relationship it goes together with money I don't know if the person that is coming they have money or with that person you're gonna start look a proposal with the page of Charlize. It's someone that is going it's gonna to come to you and it's gonna bring you a cup and say, Look at my heiress. Heiress, this is your cup, this is my offering, and offering you this. What do you think? And this is the time for you to make a decision, for you to decide what you want to do. I'm gonna get the other uh, tarot. Or I can just clarify this energy. Oh, this has been wonderful. I just bought a new phone. And the new phone I have way more memory. So it's gonna be it's gonna be so good for me to do my readings. Uh with this new phone that I have way more memory. You have you have the king of earth, it's a successful time. Confidently accept opportunities you are offered. Yes, it's a successful time. It's just beautiful. It is a beautiful focus, focus, focus. Communicate your vision. It's someone that is gonna come and communicate your your vision for the relationship, your the vision for the future. Events occur at great speed. These things are coming fast. Um, um Time to carefully review your auctions because you're gonna have also let's talk about auctions. Oh my goodness. And, and when you think this reading cannot get any better, you have the 1111. There is the card of soulmates. It's like when you just see soulmates um, uh, everywhere. Comment below if you just spend seeing 1111 everywhere. Um, contentment, peace, abundance, a happy home life. Oh my God, my heiress, look at this. You have the four of fire on the top of the, of the ten of cups. There is family contentment, happy life, successful completion of a project. I cannot even believe this reading. This is, this is quite of reading, my heiress. This is quite of reading. 
my goodness this is the energy for this reading it's just so wonderful it's just it's just something that have to be with finding a partnership finding family contentment finding finding what you want in life what's what you want in life my heiress this is what you're gonna have finding the love for your life and having the um the financial stability will this is the energy that we was talking about that you just probably don't feel right now like you have everything that you want right now uh it's talking about unrequired love and maybe some a situation they have to be with love but look you deserve love okay it's safe for you to love it is it is the 11 11 it is the the family contentment you totally deserve to have love my beautiful heiress this is your time this is this is for you this is this is the time for heiress let's see what is the message from the universe for heiress the universe have a message for you let's see if we can see if we can find out what it is the universe want to um give you his message oh my goodness the car went on the floor it doesn't want me to pick that one. <laughs> the universe doesn't want that card in your life. Okay. L I let go of the shadows of the past by seeing someone for the first time with the eyes of love. So let's let it go to the shadows for the past and see someone see someone can be the old person or the new person with um the eyes of love my beautiful heiress that that message is just beautiful i love it love it love it love it okay my lovelies you take care bye bye